Hi, in this next video, I'm going to show you how to share individual tabs in Google Sheets with people. There's no actual way to do this in Google Drive, so there's a little bit of a workaround that we're going to have to do. So the first thing I'm going to want to do is go ahead and look at my original uh, sheet that I actually want to share. So, for example, right here I have a football roster, and I have my 2012 roster as well as my 2013 roster. Now, I want to go ahead and share this 2013 roster, but I don't want to share the 2012 roster. I actually want to um, kind of keep everything here. I only want to share one of the sheets, but I want the sheet that I share to be live, so anything I change here will automatically change on the, on the shared tab. So in order to do that, the first thing I'm going to have to do is actually create a blank Google Sheet. Now, I could just copy and paste it over, but the issue with just copying and pasting it over is that that sheet uh, won't be live if I change it here. If I change it here, I'd have to go back onto this one that's the shared one and go and change that and go back and forth. So a way to do that is uh, a feature called import range. So I'm going to show you that right now. What you want to do is you want to go into the top uh, tab here. And what you want to do is you want to type in equals import range, you want to put parentheses, and then you want to put quotes. Then what you want to do is you want to take the actual URL of the, uh, of the actual document that you want to share, it does not matter what tab you're on, and you want to paste that here. After you paste that URL, go ahead and put quotes, and then you want to put a comma. From there, you're going to want to put quotes again, and then put the name of the sheet you want to share. So you can see down here that I have 2012 and 2013. So on that sheet, I want to share the 2013 tab. So I go ahead, I put 2013, exclamation point, and then I want to put the cells in which I want to share. So if I look on here, I want to share A1 through G25. So those are the cell range that I want to share on the sheet 2013. Uh, so from there, I end the quotes again, and then end the parentheses. So from there, once I have all of that put in, all I want to do is hit enter. Now you're going to see that it's saying loading. Now it may come up and say um, hashtag ref, and now what that means is hold your mouse over it, and it'll say you need to connect these sheets, allow access. Once I click on allow access, you're going to see that this sheet now comes up. Now the benefit of this is I can share this with whoever I want to, or athletic administration, go from there. And uh, if I look at this sheet right here, the 2013 sheet, and I'll show you that if I go ahead and change something there, it will change in the other sheet as well. So I'm going to look at this first kid. I can go ahead and change his weight to 150. Hit enter. And then go back here. And then as soon as I refresh the sheet, I actually did it before I refreshed it, you saw that his weight changed from 170 to 150. So now I can share this one individual sheet um, and then not worry about it, where it is, but I can kind of keep everything in one place and kind of keep adding tabs to this, but only share that one sheet that is live and goes off to everyone else that needs it. Hope this was a help. Thank you.